Laird, the science teacher here. Uh, basically, what we're going to talk about in this video is a hands-on science uh, ongoing project that I actually constructed for my students. Uh, I also do carpentry. Well, I was thinking, how can I incorporate carpentry and science and technology all in one where the students are actually learning with cutting edge type science and technology. So what I decided to do was build a 180 gallon salt water fish tank. The reason why I actually chose salt water because salt water, unlike fresh water, requires a lot more chemical water analysis. Our students are actually testing for in this tank on a daily basis. They're doing professional grade chemical water analysis. They're testing for properties such as ammonia, nitrite, nitrate, pH, carbonate hardness, general hardness, and so forth. Well, I'm gonna be quiet. I'm gonna let my students actually narrate this particular videotape so you can find out uh, what they're doing and they'll be the ones to teach you. Thank you. Okay, who do we have here? This is Matthew Affleck. Matthew Affleck, eighth grade scientist, correct? Yep. And this is Jerome Smith. Jerome Smith, eighth grade scientist. If you all can scoot in a little closer and tell me what we have going on here. Uh, this is our salt water fish tank. Okay. We're down here to do some water analysis. So we're going to begin on that. Okay, and what exactly do you test for, Matthew? test for high range pH, nitrate, nitrate, alkalinity, and ammonia. And ammonia, okay. Well, we're going to start our water analysis when we come back. Alright, what I'm doing now is taking water, salt water, so we can test for our ammonia and nitrate and, and alkalinity. Okay. So he's actually pulling water from the tank to test for the different different elements that may occur in our tank. Now what is how does ammonia get in our tank, gentlemen? Ammonia gets in our tank by the fish poop and urine. Okay. So it's a waste it's a waste byproduct, right? Okay. What does pH measure? pH is the measurement of salt, acid, and a solution. Okay, and you said something about salt. So salinity is the measure of what? Salt, salt. and a solution. Oh, okay, very good. Very good, gentlemen. So what are you doing here, Matthew? What do you, what do you, what do you have going on? Um, now we're about to test for um, ammonia. Ammonia, okay. Yes, we need to take five, five ml of salt water. Okay. To our beaker. Well, we have two bottle kits we will use. Bottle okay. one, and after bottle one, we will use bottle two. Okay, and those are testing solutions? Yes. And once again, they are testing for ammonia. They are testing for ammonia. Now he's going to shake it up. Okay. And then we have to sit for five minutes.